A few months ago, I was sitting with a friend and drinking a beer. The story didn't end with someone vomiting. No, no, the story will end today with our adventure. Take a look at the logo of this beer, Quellfrisch. Seems to be a sick place, right? Today's mission is going to be to find this place and to recreate the photo. This video is part of a mini-series which will include three videos of three mountain lakes here in Switzerland. belongs to the railway company Appenzeller Bahnen. This company drives through three cantons, the two Appenzeller cantons, Innerrhoden and Außerrhoden and St. Gall. I really like how huge the windows are here, so a lot of light can come into the train. It's very bright. <laughs> Alright, we are now in Appenzell, the village of Appenzell. I had to wake up very early this morning, so that's why I'm searching now a cop or a Migros to buy some food or something to drink. I had to walk out of the village to find a cop or a Migros because in the village, in the Dorf Zentrum, how we call it here, the centrum of the village, uh, there is no cop or no Migros. And I didn't mention it, but today is going to be a very hot day, so that's why I will also buy some sun cream, protect my skin. Let's go. Alright, now the day can begin. Let's go back to the village, to the Dorf Zentrum. Actually, I have to go back because I forget to buy some sun cream. Damn! And do you know the typical situation when you buy something and then you didn't take the bill with you? So you can't go back. <laughs> Alright, I got my sun cream, I got a parfum with the sun cream and let's, let's take it over on my skin and I had to buy 20 francs for this one. Don't forget the ears. I always forget them that I have for uh, red ears for one week. Alright, let's go. The village of Appenzell is located in the canton of Appenzell in Roden and this is the smallest canton here in Switzerland. The locals here, they don't say Appenzell, they say Appenzell. You can clearly hear that the dialect here is very different from other dialects in Switzerland, the German language itself. To come here, it took me three hours by train. I took the train from Bern, then I had to go to Zürich, from Zürich to Gossau. From Gossau to change the train to go in the Appenzeller Bahnen which I mentioned before. From Gossau to come here, it was maybe 30, 30 minutes, something like that. But in conclusion, three hours by train from Bern. Another interesting fact about the canton is that this canton was the last canton to introduce voting rights for women. And that was in the year 1990. Imagine that in a modern, industrial developed country like Switzerland. To recreate the photo, we have to go to the Sea Alpsee, which is near to Appenzell. I really wanted to tell you now the myth about the lake, but I couldn't understand anything in the internet because, listen. You see, it's very hard to understand something. It's a totally different language for me. <laughs> but I will now ask some people here, maybe they know the myth about the lake, and maybe they can explain it to me in a better way so that I can understand it. I've been asking now for half an hour, but no one wants to give me an interview or to talk in front of the camera. I ask a lot of people if they know the myth about the lake of the Sea Alpsee, but no one knows it. <laughs> I will try it at the lake, maybe there is the possibility higher, the chances are higher to find someone who knows something. So I would say, let's go to the lake. We are again in the Appenzeller Bahnen, exactly in the train which is going to Wasserauen and from there we have to hike for 45 minutes to get to the Seealpsee. It's 
it's very hot and the people who know me they know that till now I've been always hiking with my air forces with my air maxes but now I got some hiking shoes look at them much better to hike with hiking shoes than with Nikes <laughs> That's my second break, which I had to take. And I have still my beer in my backpack here. Our mission, what? But the beer is still cold. I have to stand up. Now it's not that far away to the lake. With the drone I've seen the lake now. Maybe 10 minutes of walking now. Did you see it? I said it correctly, 10 minutes. <laughs> Here we are at the Selbse. Now let's search the spot to recreate the logo of the beer Quellfrisch. All right, this is the photo. What I can see here is this mountain peak. It's a, it's a special mountain peak. And I saw the mountain peak at the beginning when I arrived at the lake. So the mountain peak is there. And I came, I came from here. So I think to recreate the photo, to take the same photo, I have to go back to this spot here and try it there. All right, now we are at the spot behind me. You see the mountain peak which is here on the label but I think we have to go a bit up to take the photo but the position here is good so we're gonna make it so what do you think is it the same spot like like on the logo I think yes, I'm very happy that we have completed our mission. We found the exactly same place, the same spot, which is on the logo of the Quellfrisch. And now I'm gonna walk around the lake and see if I can find some people and ask them if they know the myth about the lake. Because I really want to give you my promise to tell you something about the myth. The colors of the lake here reminds me a bit of the Kaumase, how I saw it on the internet. It looks similar. In the next episode, I'm gonna be there at the Kaumase. My goal is with this mini series, I want to give you three mountain lakes here in Switzerland. And I want to motivate you to travel a bit here in the country and to give you also some tips, some ideas, some plans. I hope they will be useful for you. Let's see. Uh, is it here for here? Yeah. A kurze Frage, gibt es da irgendeine Sage über den See? Eine Waage? Eine Sa Sage? Eine Sage, ja. Eine Sage? Eine Sage, ganz genau. Ach, also ich kenne keine, nein. Okay. Ich habe im Internet eine gefunden, aber ich habe also sie nicht so verstanden, weil es im Recht abgezogen die Lech war. Aha. Aber danke, vielleicht kennt ihr da, aber sonst frage ich. Ja. Okay. Ich auch. Gut, ja. merci vielmals. Schönes ja. Tag. Did you hear it? She didn't know any myth and that's exactly the same answer I got 20 times today. But I will keep going and searching for the myth. Good see. Uh, Sie dir von der Umgebung da? Ja, nicht direkt. Nicht direkt. <laughs> Kennen Sie den Zagi vom See? Also eine Sage? Nein. Nicht? Nein. Nee. Okay, schade. <laughs> Schönes Tag. See. Again. Unfortunately, I couldn't find anyone who knows something about the myth of the lake here. But I promise you, I will make some researches and to give you this myth in this video. Now we have 6 p.m. and I'm going back to catch the train. I have to hurry a bit. Cheers! One hour left. So guys, that was it for today. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Like every time in my next video, you will see this. You are the best plan. Yeah!